colon cancer screening is absolutely necessary. It was actually recommended in the past, everyone age 50 or earlier get it, but now we recommend colon cancer screening at, starting at the age of 45. Colon cancer screening is absolutely necessary. It's the second deadliest cause of cancer in the United States. We in the past used to recommend an age of 50 for everyone to get screened, but now that we are seeing it earlier, we have now recommended the age of 45 to start colon cancer screening. The recommendations as far as guidelines for when to start screening uh, for colon cancer with the colonoscopy is for the general population age 45, or the, if you have a relative with colon cancer, we recommend them starting at the age of 40 or 10 years prior to your family member getting diagnosed with colon cancer, whichever one comes first. Getting any medical evaluation done could be scary for patients, but having the colon evaluated is extremely important because if we do find colon polyps early, we can remove them before they become into cancer and we can identify specific diseases before they worsen. The average population patient who has no family history of colon cancer should start getting screened for colon cancer at the age of 45. Depending on the stage of the colon cancer, there are a lot of times that we can treat the colon cancer. There are different modalities that are used to treat colon cancer, whether you are getting chemotherapy, radiation, surgery, or even endoscopically, if it's an early cancer, we do have ways to remove it. There can be many symptoms of colon cancer and it can overlap with other types of cancer. So we certainly do look for warning signs when patients say they've been losing weight, they have no appetite. But specifically for the colon, if you had a change in bowel habits that's persisted, if you're having blood in your stools that you didn't have before, and you're having significant pain, so when you do have early stages of colon cancer, you can be completely asymptomatic. A lot of times patients do develop symptoms after the colon cancer has progressed and has become more advanced.